Hi folks, I'm at the Earthsong site crew camp here now and um, we are in the process of setting a lot of the marquee buildings. The marquee we've got going at the moment is the cafe and the big white. Now these are huge marquees so I just thought I'd give you a rundown on how it actually goes up. We have set it out first, we had to put some spikes in the ground, we put some ropes down to show the actual outline. So far we've got a spike out, we're ready to roll for the next phase of it. So we've taken the canvas out of the bag, this is the, this is the roof of the venue. And we're just going to spread it out with the outside facing up to get it ready for lacing. Alice, what are you doing here? Um, hey Ray, so I'm just, uh, I'm lacing the canvas. So this is the lacing, here's the canvas for the big white. And you just put the ropes together and it stops leaking when it rains. The roof of the big white completely laced, and we're now gonna shortly roll it up to get it ready to go on the framework like this one here from the cafe. Too much to I've got seven back here. Follow me this way, guys. Watch out for the pegs as you're walking. <laughs> this half here, that half on the field side, put that one down. There's something dodgy that's happening. Like, oh, that's falling over. Or, you know, just, just tell me. I'm the one that's talking. Okay? Field side. Sometimes I did some of that stuff. I was saying about it. You did it the wrong way around. Who can you anyway? This is field. That's row. Do you have names for the other two? Just write down. And the hammer's ready over there. So we can do the two small things. Just by the basis. Can I have um, one person who's done this before on the floor? They can come and stand by these decks. See these things here? They're called dead men. There's three stakes into the ground here. This one here pulls on that. It's not going to pull this one out because it's, it's got it there. Really strong weapon. It's called dead men. So one there. We've got another one, person there who's done it before. Yeah, right. Done Someone done back it. over here on this one? Someone who's done it before. Yeah. Yep. Right. Okay. I want three more on each one. Rick, go and stand by that person so that you're well Have away. I've done it before or not necessarily? No. Three more. Four all together. Yeah. You don't need to do it. You don't need to do it. Sorry? I'll look after him. With a pulley on. This one here. Okay. I need two people on each one of these. So, that's one other person, please. Same over here. Same over here. Two people. I'm going to show you what was the opposite end of what we're doing over there. I'll put in some anchors over that side because when we pull it up, the big frame up, we don't want it to fall over, so that's what those anchors are for. But what we're pulling them up against with some pulleys, which you'll see used later, are these things here. This is a dead man. This is what's called a dead man or a dead person. Better be correct in this order. Now, what these are are Three whacking big spikes whacked in the ground like this. Quite a mission. And this is what a dead man is. 
see the pulley system here. They'll be pulling off that onto this here. What I do here on the top is I do a close hitch around. So you can see, you can see why it's called a dead person. It's not going to go anywhere unless you've got a bulldozer pulling on it. That force there starts to pull out. Pull on this one, can't do it. This one gets start to pull out, won't be able to do it because it's got that one there. So there's backup, and that can take a huge force, and we will need it when we're lifting up that whole frame. You'll see later on. Okay, that's the dead man, dead person. Ah. Oh. Okay. When it's pulling, so you're just letting it go, nice and slowly, okay? So even down like this, you're down here with it, you're letting it pull. And it's pulling up, it's not a tug of war, you let it go. And it's pulling like that, or well, actually it's pulling like that. And when I say hold it, you hold it, you'll go like that, okay? Now, when I say lock it off, you do a clove hitch. Okay. There, right? Nice mm -hmm. tight where it was, okay? Yep. We do, you guys, at, we do, you, these guys at the same time. What's that one? Stop pulling! Stop, stop pulling! pulling. One, stop pulling! Okay, stop pulling. okay you hold this yep. on the far one over here. Okay, have we lowered it slightly? No, we'll, we'll tweak it in a sec, don't worry about it. Hold this, hold it. Hold this. Oh, that's <laughs> 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 
Well, you can't do that until the pulley's on. The pulley takes the force. So we, that's why it's a pulley. I want it slack because I want to adjust it. A bow in like we've got now. I don't want them tight, otherwise we won't be we'll be having a tug of war. That one needs to be loosened off a bit. Just to loosen off a bit? Probably just a bit more. Yeah, we'll do. Okay. That one, loosen that one up in the corner more. So it bows down. Maybe the that end too. Loosen that end off. Off. Hard. You want us to pull hard? Yeah. A little bit more. Better. Right, um, stop. There's something that's holding it, that back one. Can you loosen that back one off this way and loosen your back one? Got it. Right, so we're putting the stays in along here. You can see the stays have been put in with the poles. That's what we're doing now. Ella's going to smack that one in there and we're going to put this in. Go for it, Ella. Okay, we're just hanging up the walls here, so these come through, and they come on the hooks up here. So you'll see, that's what we've got all the way around here, the walls. You know, just hook up here like this. Pigs being put in to hold the sides down. Woo! Whoa! 